Hello and welcome back to another episode of XCOM 2 War of the Chosen. My name is Saiken and today we're continuing our legendary Iron Man War of the Chosen flawless run where I'm trying to beat the game without losing a soldier or a mission and matter of fact without getting hit. It uh, is time for the Golden Path missions. Our prime team is here, still trying to get a little bit more experience here and there. And uh, this time we need to get the suit. So join me when we're going to go about that and let's rumble. Good. We started in high ground and as always, and we got a double agent by the way, nice little Emilio. The trooper that is going to help us. Given that we are fully in concealment, might as well move up. And Emilio joined us with two grenades. Overwatch. That's good. Got eyes on a hostile squad. I have to wonder, can we remote start the top up there? Hmm. Not sure. Some of these boxes are explodable. Carefully advancing. Haven't really found anything yet. And we're just going to wait here for now until that pack reveals itself. I don't want to engage them on high ground. Matter of fact, if they would come a little bit closer, we can do a blade storm engagement. So very often, it doesn't matter what I want, it matters what the AI wants. Okay, no remote start up here. Um, yeah, we're just going to hope that they are moving. which they are not. I comply. Good, starting to become a bit more aggressive. Confirmed. Freeing up frontline shooting spots. You know what? I like the idea of just jumping up there and fan firing that thing into the ground. Let's drop the idea of using this latch here. It's not going to work. We're engaging. There was another turret over there. Headed there now. We've been spotted. Ah, down there. Okay, cool. 
All right. Um, yeah, we we won't be getting any deaths from above up here whilst they are on the same level. Good, one more turret. Good, Bladesome will kill him. Yeah, and the two turrets we can just ignore for now. There's the blade storm kill. We're being in the in the cover here, so the turrets really don't know what to do. One down. And you know, let's just <coughs> injure it. Gain some more focus. further up. Triple pack, very interesting. Hearing a sector port. And we're dealing with a lot of death from above and kills. Sorry, a couple of uh, things just popped up and I unfortunately just hunkered her down. 
Uh, could have remote started. Well, that's the problem when you're playing XCOM and real life is popping up at the same time. Sometimes uh, both don't mix that well. And lately I'm trying to record this and a lot of real life interruptions are coming up. None of your problem, but still mentioning it why sometimes I need to take a break. Moving up, moving up, moving up, we're just staying there for now. There is a pack over there, I just want to carefully move there. And that. Overwatch, overwatch and we're fine. I know I can take that pack, but I can take it even better if everybody is ready. Or if the template engages them. That would have been a nice remote start. A little bit salty now that it didn't work out. I'm going. Moves up. That's a shotgun to the face. Plackable, untouchable. I saw that one, yes. Moves up. Gets the arc on. Gets the arc on. Good. down but almost it's not quite down I could have just straight up moved down and killed him but where, where would be the fun in that feeding kills to the Templar much more fun Oh, there was a big fat remote start behind them. Well, too bad. Trooper down. And Mac down. Rock and roll. Uh, we're getting back up here. Move to there. Not a problem. Eight five moves to there. And you know since always scouting ahead let's take a good look all right back i needed to yet again take care of something so where have we left off yeah we killed the pack there is potentially something else happening right over here Look at that, Sector Pot in all of its glory. 
this is a field that cannot be <coughs> scouted out unless um, of course cover is broken and listen for us perfect opportunity no problem, boss. to get individuals down there you know what they say down and dirty um, Not a problem. that and no that elite trooper uh, there and Roro could use some of frontlining as well. Look, this here would trigger them. But maybe we do that next turn. For now, pistol overwatch. And let's just get into into cover. Cool. Well, hmm. I think what we're going to do here is pull them nicely and then just finish them up. Viper is burning, almost killed itself. Fantastic. Uh, let's take a normal shot. Good. That works. Viper goes down. Enemy down. And we'll put the Templar a little bit further to the front line. Finally the promotion. Finally the promotion we've been waiting for. A little bit more of overwatch here. Sector pod might come in and get pulled immediately. Cheddar. Well, the, how does it feel, Mr. Sector pod? Yeah, this one is an easy, uh, easier sector pod, simply because uh, he does not come with all of his entourage. Yep, Star Monster is helping. Time to play a little bit more aggressive. Switching sides. Inappropriate Murphy ignores his armor completely thanks to his beautiful sidearm. Well, almost completely.
Good, moving up. There is already an opening. Might as well take that, eh? Whatever you say. Go, go, go. Roll it out. Good, Overwatch. There might be one more patrol, but I'm not afraid of them. At this point in the game, we need to just make sure that we're not playing overly cocky. But generally speaking, there isn't much that can take us down. Okay, we got one more patrol. Seems doable. That's exactly what I just thought. Solid copy. Got it. Moving Overwatch. I watch. Moving Overwatch. Yes, You know, okay. this will trigger them. But then again, we do have a huge explosion radius at this point. First of all, let's get that purifier down. Okay. Not too shabby. My life is in your hands. Two, four, six. That would be another kill. Just trying to spread the love a little bit so that we can get more promotions. movements with all of them Roger that. On the move. and we got ourselves in a little bit of pinch point up there Look at you. They're definitely not standing at the right uh, position. Frostbiting, just so that we're absolutely certain we don't need to deal with it. Well, how about that? 
both are done. And that might be a kill. Okay, not too bad. Good, let's do what we can do, which is scanning to see where the last pack is at. Interestingly enough, no responses. Overwatch. Because there is no more pack. This is Avenger. Okay. We already killed them all. Ghost will be the one carrying the enemy, even if that reveals. The evac zone can really be anywhere. So what I would want to do, we do have a free reposition. Hold up here on the middle. On Overwatch. Kind on of up here. Running. Good, and we'll just take it from here. Wherever the exit is at. Affirmative, covering now. Good. Time to trigger. More of the invaders are coming. Confirmed acquisition of the package. Move to evac. Okay. Let's get that one here. And we're moving over. We're removing all of the cover down there so that we can nicely move out. Cool. Worked like a charm and unless there is purifier, uh, coming, we should be very much okay. The hook. Okay, so we could double blade storm, but I think that would not be a great idea no problem, boss. because of the purifiers. Instead, we're overwatching. Moves over there, Ghost moves over there, 8-5 moves over there. And inappropriate Murphy moves to here. We do have one Icarus jump left. Got another free reload. Now is the right time. Purifier. Advent 
scent stink is unmistakable. Alright, let's hope Overwatch doesn't kill the purifier. Very good. Luckily the kill zone didn't work out as intended, otherwise this would have been a completely different picture. down Icarus jump to target oh no line of sight interesting interesting well The guy might survive, so whatever. Stasis unfortunately is a problem. that gets another overwatch and I think we do have shoot on every yeah covering fire shoot on every occasion and not uh, just on enemy shots which I think stasis should trigger that stasis does not trigger blade storm unfortunately it's a bit of a uh, weird mechanic for us to not waste any energy on reinforcements I made my stance on farming reinforcements clear it is of course advantageous if you struggle you should try to do it but it is by no means necessary to win a legendary Iron Man mode Very good. We're finally upgrading. Uh, quick drop. That's nice. I would have wanted to get uh, Fortress more, but quick draw is still nice. We're going to go with Ghost. Fantastic ability. Iconic Storm. Great ability as well. And Void Conduit. Also good ability. So. But we're also going to go with quick draw. You might wonder why Saiken would you take quick draw? Well, here's the deal. Um, quick draw actually can soften up targets and uh, oftentimes you don't want to weigh, uh, use the focus for amplify. Instead, quick draw gets the job nicely done. And yeah, makes it clear that the enemies shouldn't mess around with you. New objective added. I'm keeping tabs on all our operations, Commander. Our people are standing by for your orders. This facility was clearly of critical importance to the 
No, we don't need more guerrilla operations. There is the classical UFO hunting. Because what we really need in this playthrough is being shut down. In the field, the Codex appears as an anomalous form in an almost constant state of flux, seemingly only present in our world for milliseconds at a time. Commander. I've updated our current objectives based on the most recent findings. We've established contact with Good. the local resistance Once forces in this We are no longer tired. We're going to do the next mission, which is eight days from now. So say when the resistance order is done, we're good as well. Blaster launcher, that is exactly what I was looking for. Got two more cores. Interesting choice. I'll send word as soon as we're finished, Commander. Shredstorm Cannon is the other good one. Okay. Fabulous. Advanced stock is not exactly the PCS I was looking for, but alright, whatever. I don't want a guerrilla ops. I don't think that we need it at the moment. I can foresee we're soon going to be shut down. That one I can already foresee. Uh, not relevant. Not relevant. Uh, yeah, not really relevant. <laughs> Protect the device. I don't know if I want to do that. It's too random this deep in the run. I think we might just take this here. Neutralize field commander. Even if there are a lot of psionic enemies. Keep in mind we could be shut down any moment. Cool. So prime team off limits. Let's take the secondary team, which is you two. And skirmisher plus specialist. Yeah, no, no, no. Well, yes, let's do that. Reaper is tired, so I can't take him anyways. Sharpshooter got all of the four classes. And now we got plus one. Room for one more. Um, let's do Bastard. Make armor available. Yes, please. And given his death from above nature, you get... No, you get Icarus armor. We'll put the spider suit here, dark lens into dark law into that. Two mimic beacons, thank you. the advanced repeater but if he's not hitting anything then that is a problem so might as well change that with the scope and AP rounds all right
Got a nice little blaster launcher here. Good, and that looks like an overall well-equipped team. Let's go. Sky Ranger deployed. Menace ready to deploy. Time to land. This time we do have Menace no one to on scout. Tracking the Advent General and his escorts, but we don't have an exact fix on their location. Sweep the area and eliminate the target along with any other hostiles that stand in your way. I take a new approach. We'll start scouting out. Okay, priests are a bit of an annoyance. I like the idea of high ground here. Heading to that location. Pushing in deep. Knowing, knowing farewell that we need to find the general first before anything else can happen. And look at the movement of this team. It's just fantastic. Uh, just barely too far away from not being able to grapple. another pack something exploded so I ju can just assume someone one of the bigger enemies walked through something Okay. Headed there now. Eyes on the prize. Let's get my eyes on watch. Some of this here exploded. Maybe it's just a structure, I don't know. Uh, I heard an explosion potentially from back here, but it like I said, it might be just the structure. Now. 
Still did not find the general. One of the things that we could do is we could just start engaging on them, I suppose. Yeah, I think I think we should be fine. Need to buy the way Skull Jacob Codex soon ish. Dodged it. Oh, Lord. I wanted to give him a couple of kills, and now I started regretting it. Don't have his bond made with us. Ah. I tell you what, um, we get the get out of jail card once, the presence goes over. chance 95% I think we're just going to take that to be honest yeah that shredding is helpful because the eyeball uh, really has a lot of armor rest can be done with a sniper pistol into Codex. Into other Codex that we do not see. Good. Now, do we have salvo? No, we don't. You could continue to be our scout, really. Try again. Decent, but not great. Go striking. Oh wait, that breaks concealment. Okay, never mind. Well, so much for our scout. Here. You've got eyes on the objective. 
Fantastic. That is the boss. Do we have untouchable here? No, we don't. transport the aliens are going to try and extract the general from the AO don't let him get on board that ship Whew. Luckily, we're good at repositioning. Got an outloader. So ammo should not be the main problem. Free reload. Yep. You're not going anywhere, my dude. There we go. Fantastic. Get the loot. That's unfortunately a miss. We can we need to get out of the fire. back needed a shorter break uh, we are going to retreat all the way up here a protocol has threat assessment on it I like that so let's give that over to bastard here just in case someone is approaching Moving a little bit closer without pulling something and overwatch, overwatch. It seems like we have gotten most, if not all of them, if that's the last pack. Here I come. Hello there, cutie. Oh wow, really? No crit? Well, let's try that again.
There you go, that's how crit looks yeah, like. Pack a bow. Yeah, there is still another pack, I figured. I must run. I figured that there would be another pack. And uh, Bastard it's moves able. back as well. Fabulous. Overwatch, Overwatch. They will be coming towards us. It's just a matter of time. Moves up. Nothing. All right. Good. Ripper positions himself there as well. Finally. Done. Overwatch. There we go. It was just a matter of time. Bam. Sector bit the dust. Let's take care of the sector at first. Besides, whilst we're here, for good measure, uh, of course. Fabulous. Uh, before we're continuing, how about Lightning Hands? Oh wait, he's not... He's not properly holo-targeted. Let's change that, shall we? Wilson, would you give us, uh, do us the favor? And who needs a kill? I think Bastard could be the one because we want to level him. Might as well uh, feed the kills to him. Good, that's really the last of them. Softening the guy up and feeding the kills the bastard. Very good. I'm sure we're soon going to be shut down. Untouchable, yes please. Guardian. Wow, we got a lot of majors now. You and your crew have dealt another serious blow to the aliens' efforts today, Commander. Impressive work. Okay, cool. 
Uh, that might not be bad because assorted loot can be a PCS. Alright, let's give it a go and check whether it is a PCS. Five more days and we will do the next Commander, mission. Has us in. We have to Told you. Maneuvers. It's going to happen. We're going down, Commander. UFO well, that's going to happen in the next episode, guys. Uh, thank you so much for watching. I appreciate uh, your viewership. If you want to do me a favor, leave a comment and a like down below. That always helps the videos. Take care and goodbye.